Park comes back to life. Today, Red Sox Nation flocked back to Yawkey Way for the 101st opening day at the historic stadium. Eyewitness News reporter Sarah Hogan joins us live from Fenway Park. And what a beautiful day to be out there, Sarah. Susan, it truly is a beautiful day, and the Red Sox home opener is just about to wrap up with seemingly a Red Sox win earlier today. Fans packed the streets around Fenway Park, not only excited because baseball is back in Boston, but also because Fenway Park is celebrating a very special birthday. It's the sights, Thank you. sounds, sausages and smells we've all come to know and love. And the excited fans shouting Go Red Sox! That we know baseball is back in Boston. You gotta be here for opening day. Each year Red Sox fans count down the days until their home opener, but this year is different than those in the past. Because Fenway is celebrating its centennial birthday and turning 100 never looks so good. Happy birthday to Fenway! Happy birthday to you. Definitely my number one. This was the first place I've ever been to. When I was a little kid, my dad brought me here for a uh, game. And it's been in my heart ever since. And despite the Red Sox 1-5 record, fans seem to be in good spirits. The Celtics are doing good. Bruins are doing good. We're in the playoffs yet again. And hopefully we get another cup. And hopefully the Red Sox are turning it around. Just keep the, pro the hope up and keep faith, and uh, the Red Sox will do it. If anybody can, you know the Sox will. And be sure to tune in uh, to Eyewitness News later at 6 o'clock as we catch up with Red Sox senior advisor and Tiverton native Jeremy Kapstein, which talks about, and he tells us why this opening day ranks as his favorite. Live for now at Fenway Park in Boston, I'm Sarah Hogan, Eyewitness News.